work with it. I, w I built I what built you I can give it to the... The wagon wheel on the right's fucked. Okay. I've been working with wagons oh, for a couple of years now. shoot. Man. I think we may have some spare wheels. Well, we have to get the other one off first. Instead of looking in the wagon, why don't you look up there? There's no bandit so shoots you with an arrow. Yes, sir. I need you to lift the wagon up As you all so fan out and off. look around. Everything is silent here. Sure. There are no birds, no sound of animals. <clears throat> the wind itself seems to have ceased. And the silence is broken by a single noise. What? <laughs> That's an old corn! Oh, shit. Fucking dust the wheel. The faster we can get out of here, the better. Up ahead! Form a line. The orcs! Orcs! side Kick with this leg. Tyler, you're 
to find an opening, taking it down, regaining your feeding. You've been shouted. Shoulder check from behind, right into the person in front of you. A knife goes right under the jaw. From the side. He's gonna take it. Ow! Getting it a row, DM. Understood. Any armor? Ah, little. Leather? Understood. Rolling. I need two. Need two? Understood. <clears throat> Kyler, including your armor, a total of four. You have sustained a critical injury as one of the loose blades from the orcs caught you on the leg, rolling for another injury. Just as much as you do. All right. But I'm the one willing to do it. It's fine. I'll take this. With an 11, you have sustained a minor injury as one of the blades also seemed to gouge deep into your arm. Fuck. Yes, sir? God. Hey, two hits. Uh, let's so go stand rolling. Leather? <laughs> Do you have something? Understood, the first one. Nice Leather held. Managing to deflect the blow from these heavy cleavers. Let's see. Alright. Sorry, I. Come on, get your head out. For the second one, you have sustained a minor injury, too. As one of the loose blades had caught you on the back when you weren't looking. You start to feel the warmth of the blood seep down. There you go. Need a row, DM. With a natural 20. Your choice? But it must be the luck of the end. Because as the fighting now is dying down, and as you were... Oh, there's a lot of... Dark? Running around? It's producing quite a bit of blood. With an 11, if you have no armor, you can create a light line of wood. And you fall down, but it's not life-threatening. DM? Okay. I'm getting in the cart and making myself in my... Hello. Uh, he's being fed an advanced healing potion. He had a critical and a major. 
Okay. <clears throat> With an eight plus two, the critical wound will cease to flow with blood. The major yet remains retreated. Quick pause because we might need it. One moment. Gonna sit the fuck down. One moment. <clears throat> While we are paused, are there any others who need rolls? Yeah, I'm making yeah, it I aware. Do. I rolled in the heat of the moment, three plus two, critical wound. Understood. Jordy, do you have a particular wound? Are you trying to treat something? What's up? I, uh, I got tossed around a lot, so I assume a roll. <sighs> okay. Gambus and on, yes? Yep. With a five plus one. I'll take the fog off just so people can see. a major wound. Deep gash in your side. Okay. That's fine. And where was the critical injury taken? He was holding an orc from behind that was going for Torty. <laughs> and Torty took his stab at the big bastard, and I was on the other side of it. Left shoulder. Okay. Left shoulder. All right. It was a Arms three limp. plus two. Got it. Understood. Actually, <laughs> oh, it's not on this. Okay. <clears throat> oh, what? Did I fuck something up? I'm sorry. <laughs> no. So, the heat of the moment has finally died down. You begin to inspect yourself, Please. and as you do so, you see that there's a large amount of blood Shall get him on up. the right side of your chest. Get him up. You start to realize this blood's What's producing a lot more than it should. Come on. Uh, fuck. Sir, come on. Ground. In the back of your mind, you begin to hear the I you can't be serious. No, 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 no. Get in the cart. Get in the cart. Come on, come on. Come on, come on. Come on. get behind your father. Come on. Oh, no. What does that mean? Just get back. Oh fuck! Get out of here! Get out of here! Oh!
icy old man rammed the card in into whatever that was. <sighs> Why? <clears throat> and now everyone's running over to fight it, I guess? I don't know. Fuck. We can't lose that shipment. <clears throat> no, we can't. You're right. I'm still fucked. Pause, pause, pause. <clears throat> you sure it's a minor? DM said major. She's down. We can move in. Let's go inspect the cart. See if it's still working. That's moving. That's good. <clears throat> Early I misheard, and this is a minor injury. <sighs> right. Good. <sighs> Fuck. Still hurts like a bitch, though. <clears throat> yeah, it looked like it hurt when it happened. Is there any other injured? No. Uh, check those. Did you check the old man? I believe he's been tempted to. Your party members, so called Bjorning, turned into a bear and tried to rip us apart. Good thing you fucking handled it. The Zucker single may swing to the lake. <sighs> Is my video still fucking freezing? Wait, what? <clears throat> or are we good? with the rope. You're not really fighting back. You're actually starting to help a little bit. Oh, come on. Come on. Come on. How long do we have to wait this out? 
Uh, they're not thrashing, so that's a good sign. Okay, uh, that's good. Come on, sir. Come on. Sif, with the nine, you start to feel pretty tired. And with the bit of your strength left, you start to kind of shimmy your way from underneath the cart as best you can with the help of the rope towards the more familiar voices. You're all right. Uh, hey, Sif. They're all dead. Uh-huh. <clears throat> You're all right, come on. Come on. Uh-huh. Sorry. Right. Sorry. Right. Hey, Seth. As you begin to make your way from underneath the car, you kind of inspect the area around you, and you don't smell orc on the wind anymore. And with that realization, you also start to hear the drums less and less in the back of your mind, Seth, and slowly begin to revert back to what you once were. Hmm. <clears throat> Damn, that's two slashes. Weapons holster. <sighs> one was a 15, one was a 6, so another major. Thank you. Play your power and through it for now. <clears throat> Sorry. She comes back too, and you can see a very fucking heavy gash in her, in her the right side of her chest. Sorry, this side. Get off. That must have been what did it. Does this car look like it can still move? He's <laughs> yeah, rolling. Yeah, yeah, you got hold, it. You got hold, it. hold, 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 wait. With a five, you're not very confident Frankly, how much further it can go, I, but hmm, I it's have up to you. Of my that. own. Let me use that. Make one. sure to drink it, though. That one. Well, I know that because apparently the horse is dead. From that one's know. a two. One of the axles is broken, possibly, or at least fractured. It's un- okay. unclear uh-huh. until someone gets That's a real good really look at it. Oh, all right. Sure. Okay. Understood. Drinking an advanced healing potion. Sorry, Very well. You did good. Are you okay? Hi. All right. Mm-hmm. Good. You go to drink the potion, Sif. Should I? Yeah. <clears throat> Just tired. Oh, With a, I saw that one had you uh, pinned in there. Like three plus two as you go to ingest the potion. I was you just reflexly cough, and a lot of it goes kind of spittles onto your chest. You saved me again. Unable to do his job. Is he strange? As you cough, I'm good. Just sharp pain from that He's fine. Yeah. He's all right. Everyone's all right. Everyone's holding she holding drinks up. it. She coughs up a lot of it. Oh, it didn't work. Are you injured? Yeah, yeah. Stop bleeding. Um. You saw you. And you have healing supplies. I've used my bandages. Um, I have a bandage. You're trying to get a little lightheaded, yeah. so before Please you collapse, down. you take a seat with your back against the wheel. You're all right. Are you wagon. sure? I'm fine. Yeah. Hold still. I'm good. You finished this. Get the deal done. Get as much as we're owed. Hold still. You keep him safe. <clears throat> I need to get the others back to town. On it. All right. Arn, you hear a heavy thump I'll take the, the cart then. From the wagon behind you, as Sip is now laying against it. I need a horse spawn. Yep. <clears throat> Lieutenant. Seventeen. We should get him off the road. Oh. Oh boy. Which which of these carts is moving? Oh, this is the one that moved. I need to fix the other one. Yeah. Look at me. Yeah. We need to get off the road. We have a camp nearby. Can you ride a horse Listen, back to town? We first find out what's going on. Yeah. <coughs> there's injured, they might not be able to Do you need a potion? I have a potion. I'm going to put you on this horse. Can you walk, my friend? And I'm going to throw her over the back of it. Yeah. I just have a second. Yeah. Yeah. The most injured. You get back. Okay. As you, so as you get closer and closer to look toward you, you can see the spillings yes, of one. Which of these cards is working? Around. Um, the upper part of her dress here, and there's still heavy bleeding from this cut on her chest. And it looks like she tried to drink one, but it didn't seem to have any effect. Oh, I have a... the legs. What's up? Okay. 
We're putting on the back of that horse. Understood. You help me. <sighs> come on, sir. Come on. I'd never be able to ride it normally. <clears throat> there is a sit box here, Seth. You'll have to use it. <sighs> oh, I see. Whoops. <laughs> so, Broca, you in one piece? Uh, still bleeding, but, um, uh, yeah, get he turned into a bear. Yeah, get that looked at, where's Vezra? Uh, yeah, hiding. Why? Where? I don't know. Uh, somewhere, because he can't be seen. Uh, God. Ah, uh, fuck. Fine. Fuck, fine. Fuck. You alright? Yep. Oh, that I can see. Um. You too, with me. Alright. We got the weapons in this one. We're gonna move together. You walk with us. Protect us, right? We're not too far from the camp. Uh, that's the part. Go to f- Once this fucking horse moves. Get these boxes moving. <clears throat> so is there anything else in the other wagon? Shouldn't be. It was just for people. How bad is it? Alright, you two. Move the box. Are we moving them on foot? You on guard. Let's slash on the side. These wagons are taller. That's not too far. Fine. Sarah, I'm moving the boxes on foot. How big is these boxes? Should be three or four boxes. Get them all. <clears throat> Could you get some more boxes out? Yes. Alright, nice one. Right, <clears throat> here, if you're not defending, you're carrying a box. Two more. Mm. Hurry up. I Are you good with a soul? Is the other one? Box? Then you're not carrying a box. <sighs> Go on. Okay. Get <laughs> down here. Box. They're they're keeping box. Box. I give orders. Box. <laughs> I've got the boxes. Hold on. Sada knows. All I know. There should be a fourth box. That's all of them. Grab them all. Hurry up. Before these fucking orcs come back. Alright. Do we have another pair of hats? <sighs> we got some on the way. Alright, one, three, yep. Yeah. Sweet. Carry a box. Grab one of these boxes. I destroy his carts. You too. I'm going to move the We're going to move the goods and the aliens. We'll bring them all to the gap. What are they in there? The ones that can't swing a sword, or the ones that are bleeding, or the ones covered in blood. Either way, we're playing defense. Can we just start moving? Yeah, Inside. before these fucking orcs come back. Come on. Yeah, gotta make sure everything's good. These roads get yes. very dangerous when Are you sunsets. going to bring your friends? They're going back to town. Yeah. Just us. Hey, you. Go. Go, let So. Brothers. <laughs> Does your friend usually turn into a bear? Not all the time. Or is that something new? Sway, follow me. Happens when she's in combat for too long or people cheat us on our deals. I see. That was a lot of dead orcs there as well. We take our security of our merchandise very seriously. Good. I see. Sorry we weren't able there to get to eat any sooner, we would have helped. I'm glad you showed up when you did. <coughs> I will not lie, I've seen him. What was the fucking captain's name? Captain Darius? You must be good vipers, eh? Like I said, we take protection seriously. You saw what I could hold my own against your captain. Uh. <clears throat> <clears throat> <clears throat> <clears throat> 
<clears throat> well, we're almost to the point where we get to the forest. Uh, we should be able to follow this path. This way. This All right. right. Well, here comes the fun part. Watch out, there's a hill. Others, they're traveling, they're coming with us. <coughs> no. They're going back to Nordus. Right. Strange collection of trees. Watch your steps, roots here. Don't trip on them. I it's a nasty way to lose your teeth. This isn't the first time no. we've made this walk, huh? I'm more telling the newcomers. You don't need to worry about us. We can see better than you can. We're almost there now, come on. <coughs> almost there. It's fine, chat. That was, um, miscommunications happen. We'll just roll with it. Well, welcome to our camp. Yeah, I've been here before. <clears throat> uh, the fires are prepped. We've got injured. Sir? Uh. Lieutenant, where do you want these placed? Kyler, just double checking, was your major healed as well? I, okay, so it was, someone said major, someone said minor, I'm a little confused. How do you want to handle it? You should, uh, you should not be able to take minors if your armor is actually still on and working. My armor is still on and still working. Okay, who rolled, in, do you know? Uh, Coco. told you the... I, I heard okay. major, I but my chat said minor, so it might have been me just in the heat of the moment. All right, give me one sec. Sure. <clears throat> <coughs> Let me uh, handle these guys, okay? Just look... Uh... Sure, I'll have a seat. Yeah. <sighs> Don't worry. I'll keep you in my vision. Appreciate it. <laughs> <sighs> Come with me. Oh, I could tell. Better you than me. Captain Darius. <laughs> should speak to. Shari, you have seen better days, my yeah, friend. Yeah, well, we take I'll security pretty well. Some water and some rags. How are you? I couldn't tell. Bef good, but before we do business, do you want something to drink, eat? Water. I've been made aware of the situation you went through. Water, food? I wouldn't say no to an ale. all here. Uh, my companions too. Would you want to get a nice clean of this blood off of you? I'm getting one well, of my men to get some water. Lieutenant. It's fine, I can handle it later. Go give them the balls. <sighs> Sweet <clears> yourself. <throat> <laughs> Eating the old man himself. Some, uh, uh, get them some food and water. Uh, my companions. All please. of them. Been through hell. We yeah. got win. Oh, and uh, heard some clanging. Know. Yeah, orcs, if you could believe Look it. Look at the water. Sit down, man. Get yourself cleaned up. Talk business in a moment. <laughs> I can do that when I get back to town. It's gonna be dark and we still have to travel back. <clears throat> Fair point. Very well then. Come inside and we can yeah. finish the business we just got last time. I am to made aware of what has been brought. You brought the remaining shipment of what exactly? Uh, weapons. Five planks. Like that. Five swords. Two mazes. Excellent, excellent. And I trust that none of them have been damaged from that little uh, excursion with Not the orbs. It's worth checking. 
For me to give you an absolute answer would be a lie. Soldier, check one of the crates. See the conditions of the weapons. This to make sure. Yes, <laughs> you mentioned uh, the orcs. We've been having issues with them. <clears throat> Quite a few, actually. Spotted a lot further south than they're supposed to be. We saw a kind of orc that at least I've never seen before. Grey, taller than the others. Looked like it was not only speaking common, but giving orders. Armored, too. Describe the <clears throat> color to me again. Grayish, the eyes almost had a red twing to them. Uh, rumor has it that apparently these uh, large gray armored bastards are the ones responsible for getting these bands Olympus. of orcs together and causing uh, some more issues so themselves. We're friends with Coco. He rolled a Usually, seven plus two for your armor nine, making that a major the injury. Batteries. Um, you're going to start to feel it here in a sec. You're going to clutch your uh, chest here where the wound more. was taken. So your delivery of weapons As it starts to set in how painful it is. Uh, speaking so of said weapons, all great condition. Perfect. Perfect. Now, I believe last time I paid, what was it, 20 silver up front? Correct me if yes, I sir. Look out to the right, as you see Kylo leaning over, grasping at his side. <sighs> I think one slipped through the armor. <coughs> Were you injured and you didn't tell me otherwise? I thought I wasn't. But upon reflection, it is. I didn't notice it past the armor. Yeah, I'm just gonna take the tier 3 potion that they made with the Griffin Claw and give it to him. It's just like a mage, are you sure? I have some bandages. Don't worry about it. I didn't have it out of routine. We're good, apparently. Well, then give it back. Okay, nine plus three. The potion goes down easy, and you not only feel. Well, to see. Like the pain has passed and the feeling goes numb, but you almost feel a little invigorated by it. There's a certain taste in the back of your throat from it. The agreed amount was seventy-nine silver. It's almost total It's actually quite pleasant. Most healing potions are bitter. And they're off. This one. This one goes down easy. Business uh, is business, to see. We enjoyed the work and the uh, nice show you gave me and my boys last time. No thanks to him. I have to say, I quite enjoy doing business. Muff. Muff. Good. Sorry. I'm glad. <clears throat> Apologies, so, Captain. I believe our tra transactions are complete, and I do not want to keep you if the sun is to set soon. So. If there is anything you need before you depart, food, bandages, water, do take it now. I understand. I'd be grateful. Or perhaps a torch, and he said, bandages. Would you be willing to part with some? Soldier, <clears throat> give me a crate of a few supplies. Torch, bandages, everything in between. That's very kind of you. I fucking told you, chat. How dare you? <laughs> Mercenaries are something, but being attacked by orcs. I think we can all share something in common with that. No matter what side anyone's on, orcs will always suck. Clearly mm. so. Clearly so. Have everything you need. Torches, bandages, and a few rations just to make your way back to, I suppose, not as... <coughs> yeah. Right, we have a bit of a walk, but that's where we're going. You wish for any of my men to accompany you? The roads are growing a bit more dangerous. 
I don't want to press our luck and your kindness, Captain. We should be all right. Very well done. Please, take the gift. Hands out a small bag. <clears throat> Let's just move on, guys. Insider it's fine. Bandages. It got handled. Thank should you, be more sir. than enough. Both of you. Mm. <sighs> if you're ever looking for someone else to continue doing business with, you know where to find us. And hopefully the roads are a little bit safer because of this transaction. Hopefully. Eventually, I might want to come back and talk to you, Captain. Depending on who you work for currently. We are mercenaries, does he? <coughs> buys everything. Yes, well, there's a rumor that you are the robber baron's men. Interesting. I don't give a shit either way. Because of the colors we wear, or... What are these rumors spreading from? The word was that there were robber baron men here in an encampment full of robber baron's men. I'm not asking because I give a shit, I'm asking because maybe one day when I amass enough coin I might want to hire you. All of you. I know that you mentioned that you didn't care. But why put so much emphasis on it? Does it truly not matter if we are or not robber barons, men? I made money and I'm alive. <laughs> now he's thinking like a merchant. More man. More man. I'll leave you to ponder on that question for a while, Tizzy. How about that? And well, next time you come back with a few more <clears throat> desirable items, perhaps I'll tell you the truth How about that. Very well, Captain. Until then, it will stay between us. Very well. My camp will be here, and my men will be here waiting for your next arrival, Tazim. And, Shirik, don't get yourself killed now. <laughs> you still have some things to teach the men in this camp with those sort of skills. I'll try and stay alive. See them out. Make sure they leave safely. Understood. <clears throat> Captain. Thank you again, Captain. <laughs> Until we meet again in a minute. Hopefully soon. Actually, wait, they released them? Sarah. Yeah. Well, where did they go? Out of Nottis? Away from us? Come on. Well, that's very specific. I don't know where they went. Cabbage driver. Thank you. Cabbage right. driver. Well, well, unless you're, you're going out of your way to be a mercenary now, you should probably come with us, driver. Yes, I'm a best of luck. Thank you for saving us, mercenaries. I won't forget that. We did nothing. It was all you, actually, out there. Huh. Try to keep your friends from turning into <laughs> giant bears. I feel like that's not good for a town. Although... You might want to tell your bear friend to calm it a little, huh? <laughs> yeah. I will. If only she knew right, how. Take care, you guys. Uh, we almost got killed by a bear. If you see any orcs, come running back. I will. I'm going to go fall face down into my bed as soon as we get back. I don't even want to bathe. I'm so tired. I'll see you to the road. Make sure they get to the road. And once you're there, you are off. Hmm. It's it's funny. I spent this most of the day out, and then I came back and immediately left again with you guys. This isn't the part where you slide your sword in my belly and take your money back, is it? Why would we do that? <laughs> no, no. Lose the skills of a great blacksmith. Saw the weapons; they're all great. I would oh. be stabbing ourselves, would it not? I'm glad the craft can save my life. I need the... <coughs> Weapons there are quite useful. If 
you have another wound, I'm gonna beat you to death. <coughs> not, uh, not in here. I'll stick my finger in it. Gross. That's your warning. Yeah, gross, and it's gonna hurt like shit. I thought you were going to go with them. Marcus is very capable. I was mm. going to go with them, but it seemed like those two were fine on their own. Fuck. What? Just happened. That was weird. But today's not that day. <laughs> okay. Right. That should be good from here. The tree. Safe Don't travels. Worry. Thank you. All of you. No worries. Keep safe. up the good work, eh? Hope you get back safely. We'll try. Right. We'd find mangled corpses on the road. That was us. Hey, listen. If we find mangled corpses on the road, we'll see if you got that buddy, eh? Take care. I'll make sure to hawk it into the ocean, just to spite you. <laughs> <coughs> have you uh, added that to our sheet, Tizim? I have not. I will do it now. Fifty-nine silver in total. You're gonna share. Chat seventy-five plus fifty-nine. <coughs> <laughs> you came as a favor, miss. <laughs> it's okay. I already made nine silver today. I have ten more. I mean, nine silver, and they were here trying to get more out of me. I was a joke, old man. I don't want you to play that game. Old. We're not gonna play that game. I am getting old. <laughs> we're both old. Yes, but I was getting I'm older than quite winded. <clears throat> Yes, I know you're older than me, but you age slower. That means nothing. You're both children to me. <laughs> you feel older than I do. Strange, too. I feel, I feel very old. I feel wow. like butter stretched over toast too thinly. Mm. Well, you're the most delicious butter <coughs> in all of the butters. What the fuck? The fuck? What? Fine, you know what? I'll just shut the fuck up. No more nice <laughs> service. Only mean service. <coughs> oh, I'm Ricardo, by the way. Nobody cares, shut the Ricardo. Fuck up. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> <Ricardo>. <laughs> no, 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 Ricardo, no, it's not worth it. Come on. <laughs> Bitch, go ahead. You'll <laughs> <mad> <laughs> I like you, Ricardo. What the fuck? I don't. Can you can you do the flick, Ricardo? Do the Ricardo flick? Come on. Can we take the cart? Is the cart? It's broken? busted. It's broken. I want to fucking. There's no the horse Carter to Guild's gonna kill me. <clears throat> <clears throat> no, just claim it on insurance. What are you talking about? <sighs> not gonna no, kill not you. the insurance thing again, please. Tazim, and that one guy trying to explain to me cards. what a credit was. You realize that, right? <coughs> Carry me. <laughs> <coughs> Carry me. Carry me. <laughs> Carry me. Shariq. Shariq, don't ignore me. I know you can hear me, Shariq. Put your shoulder away, Shriek. Ouch, my legs. You can walk. <laughs> <coughs> Exercise is good for you. But my legs are big enough. It's not about making Skip them like big. It. Yeah, it is. Game. <clears throat> Gain swole. That's swole? Yeah. Look at my fucking legs. What do you mean, is this swole? Well. I can crush your neck. <coughs> yeah. Yay. I am the knight. Uh, 
Is it your leg? No. It's all of me, really. Let's get you back. I'm very tired. <coughs> Took more out of me than I thought. Yeah. I didn't think we'd be fighting orcs again so soon. I know. They need to be checked, otherwise they're gonna keep roaming about. Maybe if enough of these carts go missing, the Merc Guild might do something. Well, as it stands, I'm gonna be paying for those carts. <clears throat> Shuddering to wonder how much they're going to charge me. Uh. I I can say it was orcs. I can have some witness. Maybe they want you to know how, as much. You, you know how much it's going to cost? Fifty nine silver. I will. <laughs> God, Sharik, I think I've ended. Yeah. <laughs> what about the horses too? <clears throat> the horses are alive. Oh god, I didn't even think about the horse. No, one of them's dead. Uh, oh god, no, please. We'd have nothing left. I'm gonna have we to could, go to the nurse's I, we tomorrow. Say that the, I'm crouch oh, walking. Never My mind. Feet gonna fall that off. would reveal who we went to. Never mind. Can't say they took it. <clears throat> what if we blame it on Vezran? Where, where was this ring? I like have no time. idea. He took off and hid. Him and Torty were hanging back. I went to go look for him when you... You okay? Hmm? I don't yeah. know. Yeah, I'm okay. I went to look for him when you uh, asked us to go ahead, but he was nowhere to be found. I see. <clears throat> I'm sure he has his reasons. I think he was hiding away from those mercs, out of fear that they might recognize him. Would have made things worse. I told him to back up, now. but I didn't think he'd disappear. It's all right. It's <coughs> tell me to rob a baron's man, so it has to be in. That was it. You're right. He said something about the men... He can't have those men seeing him here, or something. But what was the point of the disguise? I... Maybe the robber baron has seen his disguise? Maybe he shouldn't have come in the first place. That's hey, what I was going to say, but I don't to want Zim. to make a fight with him right now. I have an I idea. Have enough to be angry at. What? There's some horses here. We're not horse thieves. <laughs> I'm kidding. Horse thieves. I, I obviously totally don't know <coughs> this is the robber baron's men. Ah, uh, fuck, now we gotta kill you, Ricardo. <laughs> no, don't, please don't make that noise. <coughs> But yes, I don't think he should have come, but what he did was what he was supposed to do. Stay out of sight. I don't know why he made it such a big deal. We have plenty to be angry at him over. We don't need to add this to the list. I'm not angry at him anymore. You're not? Good, I have plenty to go around. I am very concerned with our talk earlier, but I'm not going to get into it while fucking Ricardo is <coughs> here. <laughs> Fuck you, Ricardo. <laughs> Thanks. I rather appreciate not, you, no Ricardo. More. Listen, we're glad that you're alive. Most people that come with us die instantly. True. We don't even I get to know, know the their names. was a really good idea. <clears throat> yes, yes, it was. I 
also walk further back if you'd like, you know, privacy. Ricardo, you're fine. Yeah, that's just sad, and that's very sad. You're not allowed to sit with us, Ricardo. Got so much sweat under my fucking hood. <coughs> God, this is only the second bridge, isn't it? Yeah. <laughs> Something ahead, moving rapidly. People. Oh. Okay. Dolzos? And Dredge. And um, is that... Fred? Why? Why is the dagger can go away. You two okay? We were coming to Are find you. Are sure you weren't dead? Ah, uh, we're okay. Just making our way back. What's going on? <coughs> the yes. worst or last face I expected to see. Huh. <coughs> Guess the hero of Nardis showed up a little late, did he? Well, if I don't have to next time, I would love for him to be with us, because I got this shit kicked out of me. So I saw. Was that on the bridge? Sif and... what was his name? Marcus? I can't see anything. What do you see? I've been paid Shariq? for. Do you see that? This is what you tell me I owe you. I don't see anything. <laughs> we have business um, to work out. Might just be it might be one of the trees. Works. Seeing things again. Maybe a body light Is it jungle. that black thing? The up walks. and down. Yeah. That's a tree yeah, 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 made. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, it looks trail. like the scary It's okay. That's what I was told. You're so and tired, we'll we get you home. Them. Don't worry. And a giant man with an arrow. <laughs> and half a day. Trust me, I'm pretty good at that. <laughs> I see. Oh. Harump. We should all make our way back. Oh, <coughs> hey, this is Ricardo, the most lucky wagon driver I have ever met in my life. <laughs> Not sure Hello? if I should bow or. That's a, that's a noble Ricardo. Fucking crap. Azim. Aether effort. Yes, my friend. We're stored here. She got sent back with Vezra. Can we keep him? Everyone else. They're safe. He's like one of those little dogs that shake a lot. <coughs> they didn't make it back to town. What do you mean they didn't make it back to town? What? We didn't we see them come in. We from Nardis. They did not come back to town. We did not see them on the road. They must be there. They're probably inside of one of the buildings. We'll check when we get there. Now, if they're not there, I'll go looking for them myself. Maybe they're it. in the clinic. Don't worry. Let's move quick. We'll find out. Come on, Ulf. <clears throat> if the lady doesn't mind a jog. Jogged all the way here. <sighs> Vezrin, I swear to God, if I wind up running through the fucking woods. Looking for you for the rest of the night. I'll stab you and I'll find you. I will stab you. The fact I hear very loud pounding feet behind me. Reaffirm, I guess? What? Him, him. 
glad that you agree. Probably best Definitely to do was my idea. Well, that's fucking meta as fuck. <laughs> I don't know. I don't know. I can't oh. see past my torch. Pitches ahead. Bold claim, Borgato. Is that fucking running anymore? Is that cunt Ricardo giving you lip? Oh. <sighs> Just say the word and I'll drop him like a sack of potatoes. Um. Oh. What are you doing out and about? I heard you got attacked by an Agmatrod orc, so I decided I'd come and join the fun. And we're fine, and it's not fun, and you're limp and lame, and if you get killed out there, your dwarves have no one to lead them. This was a stupid thing to do, Longbeard. Yes, and it was a stupid thing to leave you going on on Hello? this adventure and then finding everyone. That's why we're fine. I was not going to leave you to the orcs, regardless if I have you one have arm some. or not. Looks like you made it, at least. Um, You're not going to be a part of this. Yes, and I also have my oaths. He understands. And the, the big lady? I don't. So thank you, but She's no. fine. <clears throat> Everyone's fine. We're fine. We can all go inside now. We were treated. Thank you for your concern, Morden. I did tell you to run. Yeah, we got closed in from both sides. We handled it though. <clears throat> I must ask for your forgiveness. That was a stupid fucking thing I did. <sighs> hey, Tang. That was a compassionate thing you did. You were truly the last what person happened? you expected. <clears throat> Orkies. So I did have a decent amount of to worry about. Uh, we all came back. That's what a knight does. Oh, that's what matters. See back. Was who rushed? Was who got rushed back? The only people that were injured. Yeah. Was anybody else injured? Everyone who was injured is treated now. I need to talk with you. We can escort you. It's very important. All right. <clears throat> Go back to my house. I'll meet you there. Easy now. I'm gonna be fucking deficient. Two wagons <laughs> destroyed, one dead horse. God.
need coin, I'll pitch him. No, it's alright. I'll have you do with me. And one of the horses died. <coughs> Any of you that are injured, get right on into the fucking infirmary. We're okay. Everyone who was injured is treated now. Or brought here. Yes, everyone else has been treated in the infirmary. Sif is still <coughs> inside. How is she? She's doing fine. I'm just glad that they that they brought her in before anything else. Do you mind if I quickly check on her? A lot of people would want to check up right, run up on her. I'll quickly let Ludwig know. <laughs> Scratching the door. <laughs> you can come right on in. <laughs> Check up on her, if anything. Did they fix you up? I don't know. Good. I don't know. Go ahead, if you're here to see Sif, go ahead. Thank you. Hi. She's right back here. Who let this cat in? Get this cat out. <sighs> hey, little guy. No, no, no. This is where... Hey, Sif. <sighs> Just checking in. You okay? Someone that came running back off fine. I'll be back. I'm sorry. Sorry for asking what it felt like this morning. <laughs> She's all cleaned up. Well, you got to see a first-hand experience of it now. Impressive. How does it compare? Thank you I'm impressed. So doing that, hon. You better lock on that door. <laughs> all right. <laughs> You're all right. You have. You have. I got to. Uh... I heard someone's voice. His voice. <clears throat> I'm not sure. I said to look at him and that he was friend. Good. I have to uh, go to a meeting, but I'll uh, come by throughout the night and check on you, okay? Is, is it that meeting? No. Different meeting. <clears throat> uh, okay. Everything's all right. Everything's Rest all right. Up, Sif. After this, we'll be back to come see you soon. Have a good nap back at the back of the room, right? Uh, okay. Did ever get a fucking end? Yeah. Cuddle you all night. Days <clears throat> I don't know. She could use some company for a bit. You don't. It's as bad as we think it. It seems, unfortunately, we're going to have to do some more work. Nothing the little people can fix, I'm afraid, Cedric. Oh. Your father may not approve, but that doesn't matter to me. I will not <clears throat> leave another to die to those things. Between you and me, I appreciate you coming out. He's what happened? I wish more people would understand. <clears throat> Wait, did something happen? Shriek? Don't worry about it, Severic. It's okay. Hey. Okay. Okay. Um, Mr. Morden, I, uh... I got done sharpening with all the swords, um... I learned a decent bit from it. I put them with your iron. <clears throat> no, they played that lot. <sighs> Why don't you come in, Ladio? 
Keep you inside. Sit you down somewhere comfy. Can I get you anything? Is this private? Yeah, Dizium's coming in a second. I'll bid you good night then. Hopefully they don't have that big important talk tonight. I doubt it. Everyone's fucking exhausted. <laughs> it's been a long day. Yeah. Get some rest. Make sure to clean your face before you have a lady over for company. <clears throat> you look like shit. Right, I'll get on that. I apologize. Good night, both of you. Do you mind if I am? Um... Yeah, sure. Stay here. Thank you. <laughs> Your door open. <clears throat> I'll open it. I need to change out of this armor anyway. You can leave it cracked if it makes you feel better. I promise I won't rummage through your belongings for too long. You wouldn't find anything even if you tried. <laughs> and you know I wouldn't even if I had the opportunity. Because you'd know. Mm -hmm. One person in this town, I cannot pull the wool over their eyes. <sighs> Not better than to have it be my kin. Hey, at least I'm on your side. I agree. Good night. Good night, Sarah. Take care of them, please. Always. Is that your mother? Who? The other drow. No, it's... Sarah, why? Oh, sorry, just the way she was looking at you. <laughs> Caring. <clears throat> I assure you, my mother does not care about me. Well, did not. You look worried. I know about the list. Who's on it? The list? <laughs> the list from the Orlandis. Oh. Deserters. Yeah, I heard about that. Have you managed to talk to them yet? Why would I talk to them? Not the Arlandis. could warn him if you haven't already. I don't know where he is. How do you normally get in contact with him? I don't. <clears throat> well, he works for Swadillo, no? So does Jensen. Yeah.
More than likely is out on a contract. Then he is safe. Not true. I'd imagine. So, what was the occasion just fighting orcs for whatever reason? <clears throat> we were um, delivering some goods and they uh, ambushed us. I see. It wasn't very pretty. Makes sense. It's not many people who would deliver anything now for whatever reason well it's either orcs or robber baron men or bandits or <laughs> thieves fair enough <clears throat> I feel like nine times out of ten when I leave the city I get attacked by something As a side note, just so you're aware, Shariq, mm. they were fine. They made it back to town. We don't have to worry about them. Good. You don't seem happy by that. House and I was met with the words, oh, you're alive? <laughs> Did you rip his fucking head off? No, I just... Why do I feel like that's Bessrin? <laughs> And I know nothing. <clears throat> it wasn't, it was Tordy. Uh. Oh my god. Well, but, you know. he rubs on a fun of her good, so makes sense. He followed up with something equally annoying, but I don't remember what it was. Oh god. <laughs> I'm just angry at myself. For letting them come? I was gonna go back out looking for that <laughs> fucking idiot. <laughs> straight to the clinic made sure Sif was alright checked in with Soma made sure so Brooker was alright <clears throat> I guess their priorities are different than ours I should expect that by now I'm just a fool well, after this morning I feel like that was pretty clear What aspect of it? When you said uh, you don't think it's a good idea to do this, and he said, well, I'm going to do it anyway. <clears throat> I'm going to sit here while I rest my legs. He wants to come and sit with you. That'd be better, staring at a wall. <clears throat> so, tell, tell me, Tizim. You could slice not, not the tension in the room with a fucking knife, so what is it? I will check the door. God damn it, I just fucking sat down. I don't feel like being interrupted right now. Understood. <clears throat> I 
<clears throat> oh, good, you're alive. Yes, um... Does he have available? I'm assuming... Not at the moment. He's, uh, yeah. preoccupied. And honestly, I think you need to let him cool off a bit. <sighs> Alright. Probably go to bed then soon. Yeah. Take okay. care. Sleep well. Good night, Bezrin. Do you know about the Ar Arlandi list? <coughs> list? No. How do you know they're in town looking for deserters? Do you know any of the names on that list? No. I've been very busy. I know that Gerbrand was trying to figure out what names were on it because he was eager to cash in, but that's about it. Gabam has the whole list. As far as I'm aware, he was talking about it being easy coin. Exter, Jensen, Liliana, and a priest. Well, no matter how you spin it, Jensen and Liliana abandoned their post. I, I spoke to both of them, I warned both of them that it was not a good idea. Regardless of the reasoning why, I told them what would happen if they were discovered. Extra is strange to me. You told me that he had disavowed everything that had him in service. He should not be beholden to anyone. He was discharged. His lands were taken, his estate was taken, his wife was taken. And he was on his journey, that's why he was at the festival in Adwick before the invasion or the initial siege. He said that to prove himself so he'd be worthy of those titles again. His titles were revoked. But apparently, Godfrey doesn't see it that way. He's an oath breaker. I'm sorry, by who? Godfrey is the one who made the list, according to a source I have. He doesn't have that authority. He is a noble, a lord, yes, but... He's, he's not in any sort of... At least he wasn't when we left in his sort of position. This is what I was told. <clears throat> and from that very own source's lips, titles change. Yes, of course they do. But we were very involved with the things that happened there. The Crown did not trust House Godfrey. This cannot be an official proclamation. He didn't trust the Crown either. Everything happened, he headed west with everyone. You don't think he's... ...seceded or something, do you? I don't know. What he was all that was left. As a... Those men are under Godfrey's orders, and they're sent here to collect heads or simply take them back for justice, for abandoning the post. But I know for a fact that justice, Exodus, is not justified. It has to be a clerical error, or something along those lines. It's something that can be disproven with ease. Where is he now? I don't know. I have no way to contact him. He's usually out on contact. I don't know. He works with the Sordillo. No, well, I know he is. A... Along with Jensen. No, I, I know that, but mm. wasn't... Yes, I know that, but he was in town. He didn't... I saw him on your ledger. Yeah. He's due yesterday to pick up a blade. His sword. He can't be with Sordillo because we have his sword. He was supposed to be here yesterday. Yes, to pick up his sword. I had figured he was with you.
Well, the Arlandis were still looking for him today. So... You're right. If they were looking for him, then they don't have him. So you, mm -hmm. can, you can cross that off your list of worries. It's not the thing I'm worried about. What is? I don't know if you all have noticed, but Exodus... Not all there at times, because of previous injuries. I've seen it. It's gotten a lot worse. He's regressed so much worse. He always comes back. Exeter knows a lot about me. He knows everything about me, because I told him. And there are things he's done in Adwick to protect me that if they were found out, let's just say people will come looking for me instead. Gurbam has a list now. Exeter is on that list. It is well known in town by in the bathhouse, the docks, the sardillo. That extra is my shop guard. Then there's no As running. Soon, you have to find a noble to sponsor you. A noble here. So he cannot be extradited. He has to be in service of a noble here. So he cannot be extradited. Do you understand me? If he was in service of a noble matter. here, they could not take him. Of course it will matter. He is then part of a household. But that noble has to be willing to bat for you. Otherwise, they'll just hand him over. What about Morden? It's possible. I don't know how politics work. What if they don't him. want him for the oath breaking? What if it was something you else? Think is your assumption that's a cover for what you were just very vaguely alluding to? To keep my identity hidden, Loretta Hartford and Exeter had to kill Crown agents. House Harwin guards. What? It happened in the poor quarter and nobody figured it out. Are you Some. mad? Some. You killed the king's I didn't know own men. Hartford, I didn't make any choice. If they get a hold of him, if they come to me, it's going to become very obvious if any of them happen to recognize me. That something isn't right. This is no small thing, Miss Laudia. This is... I will have to do some serious thinking. I... Maybe it is just the oath, but I don't know. Maybe that's just a cover for something because it doesn't make any sense. There was no oath broken. His titles were revoked. When? When did this happen? Do you remember? <sighs> Ten days before the siege. Oh, fuck. Dorst was magistrate by then, which means he would have command of the crown agents, and Dorst would not allow the suspicion of dead crown agents to just dissipate into thin air. At all. And it's very possible they're here on his behalf. That has nothing to do with both. I knew that was wrong. I might be a cover then. Might be a damn cover. Wait. Lady Hartford had a hand in killing the king's men. She made the initial decision. She gathered her loyal, most loyal, along with Exeter, went to the poor quarter where they had Mr. Grey, the carriage driver who drove me from Sunmore to Adwick. 
Yes, but what was the purpose of killing these men? To stop them from interrogating Mr. Gray, who was already spilling enough information as it was. He's not a fighter. It's just a Are you of telling family. me that Loretta Hartford killed men of House Harlem to protect your identity? <clears throat> she Actress. said this would never tell she promised me she would never Hartford's have always been dodgy especially her remember she had dealings with the serpents I know what serpents <sighs> Yeah. I'm not sure as to what the Poor extent those. was, but... Who are those? Do you not remember the, there were two different vying factions, these gangs in Adwerk? The ones who wore orange were the brass skulls, the ones who wore black and were in the sewers were the serpents. Never saw those. It's hard to see them. Huh. Wait. Was one a drow? Yes. Did one have a mole? I... Yes, actually. The second. The one that would stand next to this... What did he call himself? Viper? Rattler? Viper, whatever. <sighs> I think I've run into only those two. I didn't know they were part of some gang. Best. They just bought bread for me, that was all. Even I didn't know the extent of Lady Hartford's dealings with them. What did she do? Can't remember off the top of my head, but... I don't know if she was close to the Viper specifically. Close to the man who killed her father. Do you not remember that the Viper slit Lord Hartford's throat in the middle of the that, street yes. in front of the barracks? I didn't know that the Lady Hartford was close to the Viper. So long ago. It doesn't make any sense. She was broken when I came to her. Then again, she didn't really like her father that much anyway, so I mean. I never had to say a single good thing about him. Exactly, so why would she care if. Oh, fuck. She knows all about me. Yeah, that's right. In fact, she wasn't she the one me. that told Dorse as well? Or something? I think along those lines she had a hand in it, yes. Oh god. If this gets back to Hartford... ...and they torture her, she'll know everything. They'll know everything. <laughs> I don't think they'll be able to torture Hartford. Do you not know what happened? With the death of Lord Hartford, there were no other children. She's in charge of House Hartford. She is one of the major houses remaining. The king and is not going Godfrey to persecute one of the few. Godfrey is here not under the reasons we assume he's here for. His men here. Is that who they were talking about? There was, there was rumors out in the market this morning. That there was a lot of hubbub in Coracadas. There's something about, um... Fuck, was that him? What was the wording used? The Lord Marshal. An Arlandi Lord Marshal, newly appointed, had arrived at Coracatus and had bought several Gradian mercenary armies. Sounds like the thing he would do. And there was a bit of a 
a bit of a clog in the streets because of the sheer amount of men going back to Osrin Pass. Are we sure this is something being done by the Crown? He's done things without the Crown before, remember? It's not like it's a part of our life anymore, but that very much could be him going back f to start to coup. Why House Harwin lost most of its troops. We'd be gathering desertees. He's not trying to kill them. He's trying to... Indoctrinate them. Exonerate them. Tell them if they serve him, they will be freed of all charges. <sighs> That is entirely possible. We don't know if that's true, but it is clever. We need these Harlandis gone. If they're not gone soon. Well, they said they were going to be here for a few weeks. I had thought maybe if I send a letter, somehow, someway, get it across Osmond Pass to Hartford, she'd be able to do something about this, get more context. But it's very dangerous. <clears throat> the longer they're here, the more people are going to want to cash in. And I know Mr. Gerbon. I've seen him go to the keep several times. I know he's a good man, but it's very clear he's being paid by someone. I need to check something. I will be back shortly. Do not leave. You trust Hartford. <laughs> she was one of my best friends. One of the only friends I had in Adam. Yet yeah, you didn't know about half of her dealings. No. Hmm. What was I supposed to know? I don't even know what's going on in Nautilus half the time. <coughs> Do you have any idea where he could be? He doesn't have his sword. <laughs> Would he even leave the city without it? I don't know anymore. Like I said, he has degraded so much. His mm. mind is. You think he might have just forgotten? He sold his wife's pendant. The only thing he had to remember her by. To keep me afloat. Just a few weeks ago, and I tried to fight back, I was too late. And he doesn't even remember her anymore. It's a terrible fate. I'm it's sorry. Sad. That's what I was trying to look at, into things, trying to see if there's any medicine to help. can't put broken parts and theories into an already broken machine. I 
me to send a letter. That's what I need to do. I need to understand. A letter doing what? To Hartford, ask what's going on. We've been About sending missives Godfrey. to Araland for a while and none of them have made it through the pass. Or at least they've not been returned. None? There has to be a way. That pass has been closed off for the last two years. Yet, suddenly, Aralandis have made their way through again. <sighs> Doesn't seem right. Clearly someone has a lot of money to be able to do that. It would make sense. They're buying off mercenary armies. <clears throat> yeah, several large ones. But where would all the coin come from? After the war, there was nothing. Literally nothing. No, they didn't make it that far west. Remember, Godfrey's Keep is uh, the furthest one to the west. That's where everyone went afterwards. I have no idea what that is. So it's the furthest west. I believe so. Yeah, I guess that would make sense. <clears throat> South of uh, Fair Hollow, by a fair bit. Could basically be untouched. I think your theory might be right, Godfrey, indoctrinating these people. It is just that. I suppose it would make sense with the oath. I'm still very worried about what else we did. What they did. It is quite possible, but... If he's forming a coup de grace, I suppose it doesn't really matter if he's killed the king's men before. running and running. Yeah, I know what that feels like. <sighs> Could I get the sponsor? Sponsor him. Weren't you close with, uh, was it Kovas? Not anymore. Not since the gods threatened me. They threatened you? If I go near any of the brothers again, they will slit my throat. They said do not seek help from the brothers again. Essentially. They're wanting a payout. Because I was exempt for a while. Kovas had nothing to say it about is. that. I daren't go to him. Why would I? It's my word against theirs. And the gods are always right. They might as well be no right. That raises some questions. It's agreed. Thank you, though. That would have worked.
It's taking so long. Way I miss Arlen. Yeah. I want consistency. Angry humans. And that's all it was. Mm. It's anything else. At least not on the surface. Yeah, there was definitely a lot beneath the surface, but at least you had the option to stay above it. So tired. Same. I'm about to fall asleep. I'm like I'm resting my eyes. <laughs> Same. Sometimes silence is best. Mm hmm. Sleepy time. Mm -hmm. My fucking insomnia has been killing me. I'm sorry. <sighs> Only I could die to it so hard. <laughs> <sighs> I have work at five. No, actually, nine today. As in six hours from now? Yeah. <laughs> Fucking hell, Ladia. <laughs> I mean, if it was a regular day, a day that I don't get it till at nine o'clock, I'd be going to work in two and a half hours. This has been my longest sesh, I think, almost. Mm hmm. Yeah. 
A fucking killer, like holy hell. I give it another couple of minutes before I call it. I am fucking exhausted. <laughs> All right. Something, something, backstory, something, something, the law, something, something, something. Something, something should have ended two hours ago. We also started earlier than normal today as well, actually, because we were, had the meeting True. on time. That's why I'm God. so fucking wiped. Holy shit. I was like, man, this is a really long session, and I looked at my fucking watch, and it was only 11. Uh, I was like, oh no. <laughs> I don't... Why would you do that to me? Sure that we got that. What the fuck? I kill you. Oh no. <clears throat> I wasn't supposed to take the ball. You know, like two sessions ago, at the start of the session, he was like, I gotta do something, I'll be right back, and you'll be the first person I come to. <laughs> he didn't come back until the end of the session. <laughs> uh... Cries in Spanish. <laughs> Lesob. Fuck it, I'm going to bed. I can't do this. I'm gonna fall asleep in my chat and it's gonna be awkward. Good night. <sighs> Good night. You fucking take it easy. Uh, no. 